Beating DC was pretty special. We went in with the mindset that we didn't want to concede, that we wanted to keep it close, or we wanted to, uh, to defend properly. And, and when they had scored that goal right before halftime, all of a sudden we started to feel a little pressure. But in the back of everyone's mind, we also knew that if we scored a goal, then this was over. And for Peggy to put that goal in, uh, I think it was T2 who crossed it in and, and he finished it. At that moment, DC was gonna have to score three goals and, and I knew that wasn't gonna happen. So that was definitely my favorite goal of the year. Also that last game of the year in Kansas City was also pretty cool in the sense that there was this collective feel as a team that we were gonna do something. And, and even though it ended in New England, I think at that moment, especially after that game, we thought that not only were we gonna make a run, but who knows, maybe even lift up the cup this year. When we were making that push, I knew that we were capable of doing it because we had a lot of the guys that were there the year before. It's guys that are willing to fight for the cause, guys that are willing to, to sacrifice for the good of the team. And we went on that late run to get the Supporters' Shield. Really, we were on the outside looking in with about 11 games to go. Everyone thought either Seattle or Real Salt Lake or even, I forget who it was in the East, maybe the Sporting Kansas City was, was gonna win it. And we made that epic run and, and that was a lot of fun with the boys. And so we had a lot of those same characters on the team, so we knew that we were capable capable of doing it. And if we can have that, if, if we have that for next year and we build upon that, then I think our outlook for the coming season is, is gonna be optimistic. It's gonna be fun. I grew up a Yankees fan, so to be able to play in Yankee Stadium is gonna be special in its own right. It's gonna be a little strange, but I think it's not only great for the league, but particularly it's great for us because there's gonna be that rivalry. Naturally, we're gonna lose some of our fan base, but that's okay because I know that as long as the team continues in the right direction, we're gonna gain more fans. But to be able to have that instant rivalry is not only gonna be special, but I think it's gonna be a thrill for not only the players, but especially the fans. I mean, I guess I never really thought about it being the 20th year. We are one of the original franchises, so the league in its own sense going into its 20th year is, is doing some really cool things. I think it's an exciting time right now to be involved in the league. And with the addition of the two franchises, with a few other franchises on the horizon, it just seems like growth and momentum is already there. And so to be in the thick of it here at the New York Red Bulls, I think not only is it cool to be a part of what's going on with the league, but then also to see how the organization is making the right decisions so that hopefully next year we can uh, make it even more special by winning the cup. I think the biggest thing is you see the potential. We go to Kansas City, we go to Portland, we go to Seattle, and you see these stadiums just packed and the energy that the stadiums have. And, and if you ask any of the players, it's not intimidating to play there. It's, it's fun because of the energy and the ambiance. The one thing that I felt when our stadium was packed, I think just the smile on my face represents how it felt. It was pretty special. and. There was that great energy, but there was also, I felt like, an intimidation factor. And I, I can't imagine what it'd be like if we were able to do that every game throughout the season. I feel like New York be the spot to play, but also be a very, very, it's already a difficult place to play, let alone when you have 25,000 screaming fans. So that was, that was a fun experience. It was a special experience. And I use the word potential because I really feel like if that's something that we can continue to replicate, um, it's only going to add to how special this organization is. Just thank you. Uh, thank you for your support the whole season. Thank you for making that playoff run special, for filling out the stadium against New England. We look forward to, to seeing you guys next season. So uh, enjoy your holiday season, be safe, and, and until next year.